Okay guys, Reagan is here. We're gonna go get her truck. She has no idea. So I told her I had a rough weekend bailing here with dad. So anyways, we're gonna go pull it out now. Hopefully we get the reaction we're looking for. Reagan's upstairs being distracted. Well, now that guy gets in the truck. She's a beaut. <laughs> Your dad's? <laughs> I was like, those are not it. We had to make oh something God. happen, okay? <laughs> oh that, that grill looks super cool. No more jeans and dents. <laughs> That's crazy. That's good. Holy moly. You go pop it so I can see all your degrees for it. Oh, well. <laughs> that was. You should take a look at the back here, too. Oh, he did the back, too? I don't know if he did the back. <laughs> oh, yeah. Those look really good. Oh, yeah. Holy moly. Yeah. I did pop the hood, though. Okay. So then I repainted the core support and then you see some dents there, radiator, all that stuff is all redone. Fortunately, did you rotate the train horn or is it not on here? The train horn is not on here, but I used the wiring and I bought you a light bar and put it on and it bolted through the actual bracket. So it's not moving. No, he said he, he said that he couldn't do that. Yeah. He said that it can be done with like a hand brush maybe, but he said that um, he couldn't get that with the tape and stuff in there, you know? Right. Looks good. Yeah, it's going pretty good. Well. Oh. It actually goes with the body line. What? No Chinese crap. <laughs> Looks good. Thank you, babe. That's why we didn't sleep yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> That's why the dishes aren't done. Yeah. Holy moly. We were supposed to come over here, but we didn't make it. But yeah. <laughs> why does this all look so much cleaner now? Well, he repainted the whole fender. Got new paint. This is all new. All this. Remember this? Like even the socks. Well, I degreased the suspension, but he had um. This is all. It doesn't look like what you thought it was. It doesn't, yeah, it doesn't. You're just so used to seeing it with that ugly black pump. It reminds me of the, the Lexus Second Gen. That grill looks mean, though. It's sick. I actually like the lettering. I like the balance. 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 I was worried about it being colored. No, I think it looks. Good. I feel like you could put enough <laughs> two light bars right here. <laughs> you want it to be obnoxious yeah, or whatever. So now we just need like a rose, rosy nipple. I know. I, I could get everything in. Like the reason we use Nasty Red's wheels, and that's where your stock set is, is because the wheels and tires that are going to be here, yeah. they wouldn't be here in time before vacation. So I was like, well. Well, your tires are going to be bigger. Same stance, but your tires are going to be quite a bit bigger. It was I mean, probably this well, side, wasn't it? No. Nope. Not that bad. 
that side, that side was took three hours. And it rides amazing on um Hopefully not that way. <laughs> What do you think? Rosine 2.0. good. Is she making a decent, is it a decent comeback? It's a very good comeback. Very happy. Yeah, you like it? I think it looks like girly, but not like super girly. And I feel like that's just how like I am. I'm not like, I mean, maybe now I look super girly, but I'm really not normally super girly. So I'm really happy with it. Thank you, Abby. You're welcome. <laughs> Dang, whose truck is this? Hold on, hold on. Whose truck is this? <laughs> has cleared out and we're gonna do more of a one-on-one -on -one interview with Reagan in her Rosine to does Ro Rosine 2.0 is that is that what we call it right now sure yeah Rosine 2.0 and um, I want her to give you her thoughts on what all we did her thoughts on the color match you guys get it so babe Rosine 2.0 there's a lot of things that have changed since you've seen it that's different first off before we get in this <laughs> I want people to know that like I, I don't know if people like expect like certain reactions out of people when like they get stuff but I want you to know I've had this since me and Malachi have dated which is 2018 yeah so it, I mean it's been three years 2018 and this is just now actually getting like more attention than wheels and tires like we haven't really done a whole lot to or it. or lack of wheels and tires yeah so and since it's my truck I'm a little bit harder on it rather than the giveaway trucks and that's just how it comes kind of like, it's just me. I, it's, since it's my truck, I'm tough on it. And I'm sure everybody else out there is kind of like the same way if it's your truck. But this truck has come a long, long way. <laughs> but we had a chrome Fortune bumper with the pods on. And then we decided to get rid of the pods and just go with a Fortune bumper. I don't know what they call them without the pods, honestly. Just a standard Fortune um, bumper, a paintable. And then Malachi got, a, I actually had a light bar on it when I had the other one but um, I've been telling him I've been missing another one so super happy to have another one uh, back there and I think it fills that gap perfectly super nice because we live on country roads and have tons of deer so or when we're out loading a deer up or gutting a deer out in the right, woods yeah. lighting is always, always. something or needed you have some idiot that won't get over or something those always also come in handy yeah. we also have this nice custom grill I will actually have Malachi tag him below because I know he put a lot of work into this and I originally told him to do the red pearl coat um, octane color it's a dodge color but then we decided you know what Rosine's color is super iconic for her and it has always been this color known for this color so we decided not to change it and I want your guys honest opinion should we just leave it this color so it kind of looks like not so like in your face um, 
or should we paint it, you know, this bright red as well? Just let us know what you think. And we'll eventually get a custom emblem for that. I'm not wanting to do just a Cummins or brand badge. I'm wanting to do something custom. So I think a rosine flower, that same yeah, rosine color would be kind of cool. A rose or something like that with a turbo. These are my favorite headlights. If you're not wanting to spend tons of money, I would say get the one piece. It's going to save you a lot of headache. So this full side of the truck has been in a wreck. And I was not told that when I purchased the truck. Um, no shade or hate on that person because it could have not even been him. It could have been an owner before him. But so, we'll get into that, but I am going to save this topic for another video because there's kind of a lot I want to talk about. Yeah, there's a lot on this, but for what we could have done, it looks really, really good. Yeah, so there is some explaining to do about how the fender still is not perfectly aligned. We got it as close right. as we could freaking get it, but right. there is a good explanation for it. I just, but it still yeah, really good. It yeah. Really good. Color match toe mirrors, so that has been really cool. And you got to keep in mind, like, Miguel, when he was painting these, he didn't even have the truck. Like, he was just, like, basically going off pictures now I showed him. And, and I told him it was, job. yeah, I told him it was PR4, but he said, I told him that the truck, he said, we're guessing the truck was painted five, six years ago, maybe, you know? So he's like, okay, well, I'll keep that in mind. Right. But he's like, yeah, he's got to keep in mind. The clear coat has seen five or six years of sun. It's not garage capped. So he's like, it might not be a perfect match. I want to do, you know, like a wax and buff or have it re-cleared or, you know, something at some point. It's darn close, it but the truck also, if you look here, like it's got like some film on it from our water. Right. It You can like see here all the spots and it needs like a deep degreasing because I wiped this down at the last second and there's still some dust mixed in water like all over the... So, yeah. satisfying even looking the wheel well in this freshly coat of paint because this was just black and it i mean you could see like like it wasn't clean at all like there was like paint coming over here in the wheel well like it was just a mess um, well not to mention and, you know, yeah not to mention the lower half of the fender was smashed yeah yeah because it was bent in somebody bent it in so they could clear um, when I had 20 by 12 and 35 on it. Yeah, and, on a leveling kit. Yeah, keep in mind though, guys, I don't know, Mac, did you even talk about the tires? Yeah, I, I told yeah. them already in the previous video that these tires are a temporary deal just because we needed something for the reveal, but I said that um, the real tires are bigger net. Right. So, you know yep. So, this bed is going to be but so far that we've got none is these tail lights which i'm pretty happy with how those turned out those are probably one of my favorite tail lights i think we've had i don't, I don't think i've had any oh, issues yeah. with these um no weird leakage and like sometimes, they haven't gotten like foggy yeah, or condensation when in you them you wash them you can get whatever moisture getting in there we haven't had any issues with that once we can we're going to take this whole truck and whatever he hasn't painted yeah he's going to paint just yeah. because it has been so long since she's had paint and she's been kept outside. Obviously, the roll pan hasn't been done. But the roll pan is spray paint right now. <laughs> but I'm happy that it actually looks a little bit more like we're getting there. Like we're getting yeah. closer rather than super far like it did on stocks. And, you know, with a black bumper and chrome gray. It, just, it was something that kept getting pushed back just because it's not at the top of our list. So super happy with how it turned out. And I actually feel like I can drive this and take it to shows without, you know feeling like it looks like complete <laughs> uncomplete <truck>. yeah <laughs> you know it looks like it's had some modifying done to it but we aren't done with it obviously i've had it since 2018 just be happy with where you are now and sometimes the results come a little bit later but trust me in the end they're worth it you can apply that to basically anything in your life so <laughs> yeah if you had to pick two things you um, liked the most two things i like the most Ah, uh, pick, pick three then. The whole front end. The whole front end. The, the grill, the bumper. I love the light bar. Uh, it looks like it needs cab lights. <laughs> now it that does. I it, it looks so aggressive and mean. And like I said this, I said this multiple times. I'm like, it looks girly because like I think of a red nail, but it doesn't look like girly like where it's pink and screaming it, your face yeah. when you're super girly. It just looks mean and aggressive. And uh, I'm super happy with it. This pole front makes this whole truck look like not even the same it does it doesn't even look like the same truck like, no I it doesn't I think we have a lot of when i came out i was kind of in shock because like truck i've never seen this truck obviously color match and i think i was in a little bit of shock in the beginning 
beginning because I thought I've seen in my mind, you know, you think you picture it all color match, but it really doesn't do justice when it's actually all together and in front of you in person. And it kind of just put me in shock. I know mean, it's been tough for Malachi getting this done. Yeah. And we had moments, <laughs> husband and wife moments, where we're kind of going back and forth about which bumper we need to go with and what size wheels and what size tires. And But in the end, I'm happy that it's done and happy that we've actually, you know, are starting to move a little bit more with it. So super happy. So on another note. So guys, this is your last week to enter for this truck. This is a 2005 5.9 Cummins and this thing is so fun to drive. Like, I mean, so fun. Like I can steal this, I steal it because that's how fun it is. And I'm not a person that usually takes the giveaway trucks and wants to constantly drive them just because this could possibly be your truck and I want nothing to happen. But this truck, <laughs> I cannot pass it up and you cannot pass it up. So go to lmpgear.com and place those order guys. We have so many awesome things you can choose from. I put tons of work on the website, customer service. Malachi puts tons of work in the videos um, and we hope you guys enjoy everything from the videos to the customer service because it's all about you. So get those entries in. Thanks for watching. Leave a like, peace. Peace, last week, get those orders in.